Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Crusader Kings 2 as the Republic of Amalfi where we left off we have just conquered Capua so let's unpause and see what kind of trouble we can get into we can create the Duchy of Capua I mean No, we are not gonna create it. Let's dismiss this for now because as I remember our wife was pregnant, yes. So I was thinking about our little campaign here and I think we need to be very opportunistic because we have a lot of huge empires around us like Lotharingia, the Byzantine the Byzantium or Byzantine Empire, the Aglabid, Tolunid. So we need to thread carefully here. We are trying to fabricate a claim on Benevento. Let's see can we do more trade posts? No. But our great mansion is constructing. Can we do anything with our money? Let's see, upgrade our trade post, yes. Let's go to merchant port 3. I'm gonna put the speed up to 4. Nice, we have a son and he's quick. Tiberius. Yeah, that's a good name. Excellent, so now we have an heir. We just need him to come of age. Can imprison someone for he is the leader of a plot. Kill some douchebag. You can kill him, I don't mind. <clears throat> or not because this guy would inherit and make him stronger. I guess we can kill him too. Let's see. Oh yeah, we can get his spy master. So send him a gift. And he's as good as dead. Let's approve the plan. Excellent. And now this girl has the title. Can we revoke her title? No. I would like to own all of this. These five counties here. I would like to be mine, but We have built a merchant post. Let's build a merchant enclave. And let's hold a summer fair to make the peasants happy. Let's allow them to stay. The music in this game is excellent, I think. But it seems like with every patch they make it easier and easier. That's why I'm kind of doing this um, more like a role play because if you were to speculate all the things the game gives us we would become huge very soon and that's not 
realistic. Oh, we are stressed. The Greek populace in Amalfi resent me as a ruler and I feel that I am foreigner. Yet I depend on this self-same people to collect my taxes and men, in, and men my army. This simply will not do. I think it is time to bring some boys from back home over to help me out here. Nice. So Amalfi becomes Roman. Excellent. Come on, give me a claim on this guy's county or duchy or something. And we have conver converted Napoli to Catholic. Let's see, what can we do with our court chaplain? Let's make him improve religion relations with Rome. The Pope likes us, but it could be better. I'm thinking it will be a long time before we can create... What king is here? Sicily? Yes before we can create Sicily oh yeah and great mansion has been built so just let me know let's see can we improve our mansion in any way no Let's build a fortified vault and give that barony away. Sorry, I just hit the mic there. Can we declare war on Foggia? No. No. And our wife is pregnant again. Excellent. Some douchebag died. But this guy, Musco, will not be a match for little Tiberius here. Look at that marshal. He, he is 3 years old and has a marshal score of 5. Nice. And we are a Midas touched. So we will educate him and hopefully, hopefully he will get Midas touched as well. Another boy. Excellent. Gallus. Of House Didius. Let's also build something here. Merchant Enclave level 2. Can we kill someone or do something? Only our wife. But we have no reason to kill our wife. Because she's pregnant again. Excellent. Is she lustful? No. And we've got a claim on the county of Benevento. Excellent, excellent. Oh, we need to save up some money before we can actually declare war. And move you here. No.
Let's try to get kind. It didn't work. Now their war is over. We are almost positive on money. It's almost time. You know what? Let's just declare the war. And another son, who is also quick. Excellent. Sempronius. We can upgrade our legalism. And why don't we just declare war? Oh, we cannot because we are bankrupt. Oops, I forgot. So, now, declare war. Let's raise the troops. We'll only raise our own. And go with there. We will first crush his armies and then siege. He's not even trying to escape, which is excellent. And let's go sit on the province. We are not in a rush, so we are not gonna assault it. We'll just let it finish on its own. We can build a university, but it's very, very expensive. And after we conquer this guy here, Benevento and Foggia, are you his heir? No, you're his brother. Can we ransom him? You for some gold? Yes. I think we'll try to expand somewhere, somewhere in this area, into the Muslim land because it will be extremely hard to get some land out of Lotharingia or the Byzantine Empire. We can also try Croatia. We'll see. Man, I always forget to unpause the game. And do you want to surrender? Yes. Excellent. And we now have another holding, oh no, I'm sorry, another province. Our secret passages have been built. Let's see, can we build... I think we're gonna save up for the Merchant Enclave level 3. And our court chaplain died, but we have a better one. Why don't you... Yeah, just research cultural tech in our capital. And disband the troops. You guys stay there. Can we raise any more retinue? No, just barely. We are missing 92 guys. You know what? Let's give our wife some money because she did a great job. She gave us three sons. Two of which are quick. And our marshal died. I'm definitely not gonna put you as marshal. You know what? Let's find a guy. Let's search for men who are not imprisoned. <clears throat> 
Any marriage, ruler, no, my religion, yes, any culture, yes, an adult, any of great house. And let's see. No. No, 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 no. This guy might come. He's 67 though. Let's search for another one, a younger guy. 49. It's better. White card? No. You little... You know what? Let's just try this guy. No! Alright, whatever. Let's just put... This guy. And... Research military tech in our capital. And our heir is ready to be educated. I think I will educate him myself because I want control over what his traits and stats will be have you gone insane he's mad arrest him and demand his religion conversions let's give patronage wait for this guy to get out of prison so we can put him back as our court chaplain Yeah man, so this game, I think it's getting easier and easier with every DLC, with every patch, it's just getting easier and easier. And our wife is pregnant again. Nice job. We need a lot of babies. Let them in. Tell us more about Hindustan. Let's accept his gift. This guy is actually extremely good. You know what? You're okay. And let's put this guy as our spy master. Should we research tech? I think we'll scheme in our capital because our heir is not yet of age so right now we would uh, lose the election and the control of the republic so better to be safe than sorry. We even have combat modifiers. Nice. And another son, Tacitus. Excellent. Let's humble. I think we'll go with kind or zealous. Zealous is good. It gives us piety and a plus two to the martial ability. Can we betroth him to someone good? Like a carling, but I think because he's quick, we'll try to get him a strong or a genius wife. Don't we already, already have charitable? Yes, we do. So, I remember those two. Let's see, can we build anything else? 
How about in our city? City guard for more troops? Yeah, why not? Some random culture died. But I think I will end this one here. So thank you very much for watching and I'll see you next time.